Hello everyone, welcome to Digital Board Games. We're going to be playing Lanterns today on our phones. I'm super excited about it. We're going to be battling Dr. Glory Hog today, who is also here with me. So Dr. Glory Hog, this is the first time you're playing the digital version of Lanterns. And of course, our YouTube comments are not working, so apologies for all of our YouTube viewers. I'm going to try to pull up comments and stuff like that for you guys. Hello, we have, let's see here, who do we have? We have Michael in chat, and we have Battlecry. Thank you so much for joining us today. Have you guys, either of you guys, played the digital version of this before? Go ahead and let me know in the comments, and I'm going to check YouTube to make sure I get all of our comments in there. I know, I don't know why YouTube has been such a pain lately. <laughs> it's like terrible. <laughs> all right, hopefully I'll be able to get these up here. And then we'll get started. Dr. Glory Hog has already made his first move because he's a super sleuth like that. The thing I'm really happy about is the fact that Dr. Glory Hog cannot see my hand this time. <laughs> you can't see anything I'm doing. All right, I think I got my YouTube pulled up too so we can make sure that you guys are on there. Okay, I'm going to get started. Now, if anybody doesn't know the way lanterns works, what we're going to be doing is we're going to be placing these little tiles here. I have three of them here, and I can rotate them any way I want. And let me get the music going, too, for you guys, Glory which Hog is super cannot fun. See my hand. And I'm going to be placing these. And whenever I place these, the person, Dr. Glory Hog, is going to get whatever's on the top portion. And if this was a four-player game, whoever's to the left is going to get the color to the left. Whoever's on the right is going to get the color to the right. And then I'm going to get whatever color is facing me, as well as any matching colors that I make on here. So I'm going to be trying to collect sets of fours threes and then the multicolor sets here as well. Let me mute that. Okay. Let me know if sound is good for you guys as well. Dr. Glory Hog, do you have any tips you want? I mean, you haven't even said hi. <laughs> you were kind of going. <coughs> I didn't want to steal your thunder there. Oh, you don't, didn't want to steal my thunder. <laughs> yeah, I felt like a participant. I was like, I'm just going to watch, see what she's up to. Um, the interesting thing is with two players, I feel like we won't run out of lanterns as easily. If you play with three or four players, you can easily run out of lanterns and really set it up to where somebody who might be in the lead doesn't get something based off the way you place your tile. I don't know if that's going to come into play as much with just being two players, though. But you do have less. If I remember right, you do have less lanterns when you have less players. So maybe it will. We'll have to see. That'll be my elite plays. We'll be trying to <laughs> shut plays. you down so you don't get anything. Oh, thanks. You're so nice. All right. So Since I can't cheat by looking at your phone, which I is know. apparently all I do. That's all you do, Dr. Glory Hog. You're so cheaty. Why do you got to be so cheaty? It's like <laughs> smearing my name. All right. We're going to put this over here. I don't feel like I have like a ton of really great moves. And, oh, and, of course, these little, like, flowered-looking tiles, anything with a little symbol in the middle is going to give me special stuff that I can use to switch out other tiles and colors and everything. That's nobody has nice. played Nobody has played the lanterns on their phone. Oh, Guys, nice I play... Oh, Dr. Glory, huh? I got the blue because <laughs> I connected there, and then I got two purples because purple's facing me, and I connected the purple. So that was good. I got three lanterns off that. The the art that was done on here is so fantastic. This is one of my favorite ways to play lanterns now. And plus, you can bring in like a ton of players. It's all relaxing and like pretty and everything. It's so nice. They should add Jaws to this game so that occasionally Jaws will pop up and eat a tile. Oh, really? <laughs> <laughs> that would definitely change the way the game is played, I think. Yeah, you would just <laughs> it'd be doing its music and all of a sudden it would be like, da da it sucks because I gave you like a prime location for something and then that just didn't it didn't benefit me at all. Yeah, it did not. I was very curious of your play there. But, you know, I never discriminate. If you want to give me really awesome stuff, then I will let you. Because I'm nice like that. <laughs> Why, thanks. Well, you're welcome. Mm. What you doing over there? 
trying to figure out how to get all the colors I need, but I'm not going to be able to get all the colors I need out of this. Hmm. So far, guys, this is not looking good for me. <laughs> I'm just going to say. Excellent. All right, we'll try to do this. I mean, I'm sorry that happened to you. All right, hopefully this will work out for me in the future. Hmm. Do I want to make a dedication? Kung Fu Panda is more appropriate. I agree. That would be super awesome. We could do everybody is Kung Fu fighting. I'm going to immediately do a dedication because every time you take a dedication, the one underneath it is going to be worth less. So by taking the three pairs right now, I've made it worth less for every other person that tries to take it. You're going to uh, maximize your points there. Yep, yep. Now I'm trying to figure out what I want to get now. <coughs> I'm assuming you're setting yourself up for like this red-white business going on here. Why would you assume that? I mean, you took the other one, so I don't really... It's okay. I'll set myself up really over here. Like. Give myself some sweet whites, some oranges. And I'm done. I passed my turn. <laughs> <laughs> Right now it's asking me if I want to exchange any lanterns. That's because of the dedications and stuff, which I'm going to skip. I don't want to exchange any lanterns right now. Well, it's now. because you placed on a tile that has the symbol in the middle. So you got one of those little favors, right? Right. Yeah. yeah. So I'm saying, but I don't want to use my little favors gifts. Yet. Yeah, ma'am. My little favors yet. yet. This is all about honor. So well, that's not what I want to do. Try to be honorable if you could, please. I cannot promise you that, okay? <laughs> it does not look very honorable. I'm just I saying. I cannot give you the promises on that. And, oh, I can't remember what the maximum amount of lanterns is. It'll tell you. It'll say if you don't put something down, it'll say that uh, you'll have to discard They're two They're like, you're lanterns. wrong. I'm just saying the app will tell you. I don't remember what the number is offhand either. I feel like this you, will be okay. Did you pass turn? No, I'm, I'm oh playing right now. Okay. That was not okay. What was that? What? That was... What do you mean? What? That was not good. What? What do you mean? That's totally fine. Okay, okay. Listen, that tote's fine, okay? If that's how you want to live your life. Um, I think that is how I want to live well, my just life. just got <laughs> higher standards, I guess. What is that supposed to mean? No, no, how no, do you no, have it's higher fine. standards? It's fine. You're fine. Oh, my God. Just saying, I'm playing at a different level, I think. Just a level of excellence that you're just not quite there yet. So you could get on my level. That might help you. It's a mad, mad computer game trash talking. All right, so I'm going to make a dedication. I'm going to do my multicolored dedication there. Uh, is it going to be one of each? Rainbow this is gonna be. It is going to be rainbows. Are you going to sing the rainbow song? What's the rainbow song? Rainbow Connection. No, I'm not going to do that. <laughs> I needed to get that rainbow before Dr. Glory Hog gets it. What are you talking about? I'm like super far away from it. No, actually, I'm not. I'm no, not. you're not. You're like one away. Exchange a lantern. Hmm. That's so tempting. Sure, I'll do that. I'll make a dedication, I guess. So I will now take seven uniques myself. <laughs> so fancy there. And bam, back on top. <laughs> 18 to 10. It's all part of my plan. You still got to play some tiles. Yeah. Oh, I give know. Give me some sweet, sweet stuff. When if I you could just give me all the points, that would be fantastic, Listen, when Dr. I Glory Hog. tile, you're going to feel it I'm like a cold wind. <gasps> and has everybody in the comments played Lanterns just like the base game and stuff? Have you guys done that before? I know that we had. There you go. Have some sick green. Well, I need some of that. Thank you. Why, thank you. Thank you. That green is poison. <laughs> what? I hope you choke on it. It's a poison <gasps> apple. Oh, Why my is there a nickel gosh. here on our floor? Pay no attention to that. <laughs> Got that and a fat dog just licking her paws. This is It's really going to hurt me carpet. if I f forget, like, how many tiles I can have here. You usually tend to hoard, so. I do tend to hoard quite a bit. Quite a bit for no great reason. It's not to her benefit. She does it anyways. <sighs> what are you leaving me with here? The nothing, best. Thank nothing, nothing. So get a little blue, black, and get a little favor. Look at that. Look at these gifts. Aww. Aww. 
cute little gifts. Aww. Get some blue, get some black. It's looking good. We're going to skip exchanging a lantern. We're going to make a dedication. We're going to get one of those. So who else is coming out to Phoenix to go to the uh, Magic the Gathering Magic Fest? Phoenix, Arizona. Anybody? I don't know. Anybody? I don't know. Yeah. I'm going to go. So I heard there's only three pe 300 people signed up for it, which is quite small for one of those types of things. So it's making me think maybe I should sign up for the main event. Oh, yeah? If there's only 300 people, it's a lot easier to get into day two. But, I mean, we've got, th some of the other ones I've gone to had like over 1,000 people easily. And I still got close. So I'm just thinking maybe. But who knows? Be a good, be a good time for you to go and do that? Maybe. I don't know. So what I'm going to do here is called awesome. <laughs> and I'm going to. Just go ahead and rack up these points here and give myself a green, a green, and an orange. And just throw it down like it's hot. I see. Mm -hmm. I like that. That was good. All right. What do I want to do? Nothing. <laughs> you want to pass your turn? Ooh, there's no more oranges left. I shouldn't have said that out loud. <laughs> go ahead and set yourself up with an orange. So we did have a situation where we ran out of a certain type of tile. Right. You're over there hoarding oranges. Well, there's only five of each, so it's actually pretty easy to see what's available. And that's when you get – this is when the game gets kind of really tricky when you're trying to, like, give yourself stuff but also make it so like that. Like, you didn't get any oranges, but I didn't get any oranges. You just got the thing? No, I got an orange, but I made sure that I was able to get an orange and you were not able to get an orange You did on not get turn. an orange because you had two oranges and now you No, I turned two. in. I turned in. Oh, and so you just got them back? Yeah. Ah. I see. Well, no, I got an orange and a blue, and if I put one back whenever I made the dedication, then you probably got one too. Who knows? I mean, that's that's how the game works. I think <laughs> – <laughs> the game. We'll do the replay later. <laughs> Overall, I pretty much try to have a plan, but I've already worked myself into having too good of a plan so that, like, my plan makes me less points as I go along. So okay. I'm going to have to change my plan here. I like it. I went hardcore rainbows, which I love doing, but I kind of went into the... The rainbow danger zone is what it is. That's what I went <laughs> into. <laughs> okay. If you could give me cool stuff, that would be awesome. Um, I gave you a green. Wow, that is not sufficient. I was not a little busy sufficient. getting two gifts and three ti and three uh, lanterns myself. Okay, I can't just be giving you everything. I need all the things, guys. I need all the things. You need nothing. Three sets of two is actually uh, not super easy to do all the time either. Our kiddo wants you to know. Taste the rainbow. Taste the rainbow. <laughs> That's how we get so our Skittle so sponsorship that, right so there. Greg, we, we went to Rencon. Greg was playing Obscurio with a different group, and he had messaged me saying that he was getting ready to play a game. So I came down, and Obscura is one of those games where you have to close your eyes during a portion of it. So Greg, in the middle of this convention hall, with his eyes closed, I snuck up behind him, got real close to his ear, and I just said, taste the rainbow. And it freaked him out. He's like, ah, and he like knock, almost knocked stuff over, and then people were like, what's happening, what's happening? Because he like, I guess I scared him really bad by saying, taste the rainbow, into his ear. He was not ready for it. Gosh, are how many of each? I know, I'm thinking, how many of each tiles are there? I five. can't remember, five? In this in this game, there's five. Oh, that's not going to be helpful for me. That is not going to be helpful. You can't get any orange at this point if that's what you're trying to do. Yeah, that's what I was trying to do. Is that a shark? Oh, no, it's a little koi. What happens a to shark? <laughs> I was hoping. <laughs> yeah, I don't think there's any sharks in the game. I just don't have any of the tiles I want, guys. Mm, you need to play something. I know. I'm taking forever. I guess I'll just do this. What was that? What was what? Nothing. 
The, I don't. I didn't have a whole lot of really good moves. Right. 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 <laughs> Listen, I know you want those rainbow tiles. Or if you could put more oranges back in there, that would also be really cool. I think that when you play this in the iPad version, you can see more of everything. Like you can see the tiles that are left and everything. So I believe I prefer it like that. But on my phone is like a quick, easy thing where you can do turn-based stuff. Which is always nice. Because. Is there a magic carp? There is not a magic oh. carp. Our kid's coming in with some really astute questions. You're here. just blocking me with everything. That is rude. You only have two more tiles left, huh? Or do you have three? I guess I played first. Okay, Probably should I feel like I'm just alerting you to things like the board stay. I should not even be telling you. You've got so many turns to catch up and make points. I wouldn't worry about it. Oh, yeah? Tons of time. Game is definitely not going to end soon. No, I didn't want to do that. Ah, oh, I totally messed up. What would you do? I want to go back. <laughs> I don't think there's an undo. I exchanged two things that I didn't want to exchange. Oh, guys, that was so much fail. So much fail. See, this sauce. is one of the times I'm, I'm actually so sad. Upset. That I don't get to see what you did. I'm so upset Are you right tell now. Me later? Oh, I just stepped on a piece of lettuce. Why is there lettuce in here? Dog, eat oh this lettuce. Oh my gosh, guys. I just ruined my entire plan. It's over. <laughs> I don't have anything left. We're going to start over. We're going to have to play over again. <laughs> I'm going to need everyone to actually tell me <gasps> if she actually messed up or if this is just her excuse oh, for doing it poorly. Oh, it's so terrible. I can't, I can't tell you. It was so terrible. Did you drop a tile yet? I'm I'm so ashamed with myself, you know? There it is. So at the end of the game, if you have... See, so for example, this right here says, uh, make a dedication. If you do not, you must gis you must discard down to 12 lanterns. Okay. So tell me right now, like, I better do something. I'm going to get wrecked because of this last m that last move. It's going to be a tight game. So if there is some at some point where we ended up tying in a score, then the little gifts that we received throughout the game would determine who was the winner. So if you have the majority of gifts in the game, then you're going to be able to win the game with that and then a tied score. You know, I've only played this, too, with two players back and forth in, like, a longer game. Does that make sense? Mm-hmm. If it has much sense of pig on a lipstick. Wait, lipstick on a pig, not pig on a lipstick. I'm real I don't hungry. Even know what I don't even know what you're saying I'm right now. I'm real hungry. <laughs> I was looking at our chunky dog, and I was thinking about pigs. Those are my chips. You can't have those. I feel so disconnected not getting to see anybody's comments. Are there people out there? <laughs> <laughs> Are people saying stuff? It's quiet. It's pretty okay. quiet right now. Yeah. So <laughs> we had we had Michael and Battle Cry on Facebook and everything. It's a it's usually pretty late. Pretty late for the people. Did, did you place your tile? Not yet. I oh I got distracted God. by talking. Gosh. What do you think I should do? There's only so many options here. Should I go for seven points, seven points, or six points? <laughs> <laughs> oh, there's only so many moves left. You've got what, two more tiles? I do have two more tiles. You're going down, clown. Me? Yeah, well, yeah. Oh, my gosh. Because I'm scoring on this next one, too. There's nothing you can do to keep me away from my honor. It's just, yeah, that, that last part, it doesn't really. I'm not happy about these choices, but there's not much I can do, mm. guys. So I want to make a dedication. So you actually made it, the choice for me. I'm Did gonna go I? For this sev yeah, because now it's six, six, and seven. So I'm going to go for the seven-pointer, just on the sly. On the sly. And uh, look at this. I'll just ready. I'll just 
boom, like a dynamite. I didn't even have to flip that one around. It was so perfect. I think you're going to go ahead and, like, win by a very minimal point point range here. Maybe. Well, I mean, the most points you can get now is six. We'll so 38 see. to 41. We'll That's see. a pretty decided victory. Wow. Okay. <laughs> Oh I think my everybody goodness. knows lanterns. If you win by three, it's a uh, bloodbath. It depends. If I had another turn, I could just turn in again and like get another dedication. But I don't think I get another turn because I've got three pairs and I've got seven uniques. All right. Gonna make a dedication. Okay. Hopefully this will like just perfectly work out for me. We'll see here. I don't think you get and to do another Battle one. Battle Cry says do. listening and browsing STL files for my 3D printer. Oh sweet, Battle Cry. What are you printing? What are you gonna be printing up? I like, like what want are you one of those. Do? I just don't want to put in any effort to actually do it. I just want the finished products. Oh yeah. Yeah, I basically want what you they just have. want the things. I want a replicator like <laughs> they have in Star Wars, so I could just <laughs> or Star Trek, where I could just be like, I want this thing made, and it's just like. <laughs> That's awesome. Are you going to make your dedication, or are you still waiting on that? I'm placing my last tile. God. Oh, it's just now giving you your points. See, and I think that's just the end of the game. Oh, no, no, you get a final round. You get a final <laughs> round. So what do you have? You've got a rainbow or three pairs, so you can do either one. No, you have a rainbow or three pairs. You can do it either one. <laughs> oh, you have only the three <laughs> pairs. Is that correct? Yes. Oh, because you don't have those other ones. So then, of course, I've got to take the three pairs. So if you yeah. take it, it's worth even less. Because I'm a nice guy. I mm. totally, totally messed this up. Totes. Boom, 47. Feel All free right. to come at me, bro. We're not going to exchange anything. And then we're going to go ahead and do one of these. Which just goes to show that going for all the rainbows the entire time does not necessarily win you the game. Well, because they become worth less and less as time goes on, yeah, too. So like absolutely. You got to be careful of that. I had made a dedication that just ruined. I exchanged something, like, really oh not God. good. <laughs> You'll have to go back and watch the replay. <laughs> All right. I will. There are challenges in the game that you can end up unlocking as you go through, which is super fun. So it's like use this many of the black or collect this many black lanterns and do these things, which is always fun. All right, game complete. I hope you feel happy, Dr. Glory Hog. Yeah, no, that was pretty cool. <laughs> How do you feel about the app? I like it. It's good. Yeah, because this was your first time playing it, and this is something that you maybe want to play with me again sometime? No, I mean, I've already won. Like right know. now? I don't even know what's the point. I've already won. Yeah, I'll play you one more time, so that way you can try to redeem yourself. Okay. But, I mean, I'm undefeated at this moment, so it seems kind of pointless. It's just hard when you're this good. I get to go first again. Is it you because you You get to go challenged? first again. I did challenge, yeah. Boom. All right, we're going to go to the game. I already laid a tile. I know, I know. There's a baby shark swimming around my, t my little lanterns. Oh. Oh, it disappeared. Oh, my God, where did it go? <laughs> Where did it go? You don't want to go in the water now. <laughs> Seriously, though, where did that koi go? It just disappeared. Oh, there it is. It's teleported. All right. What do I want to do? Why is this? This is like a little magic carp. What is it doing? Is it, oh, God, it's going to disappear again. It did. It disappeared again. Wow, there's a lot of... If you scroll, there's a lot of water space here. There is, and it is, there's, like, super cool stuff, like, happening in that water space, which is always a ton of fun to just sit and watch, you know? Now, how do I get back to tiles? Jeez. I started looking around for stuff, and I got, like, lost. Did you place your tile? I sure did. Okay. You sure did? Or I sure did. So I placed my tile specifically like that so you wouldn't get extra stuff off of it this time. Like this where I go bloop and I get double gifts. Yeah, but at least you couldn't get three. Okay. At least you couldn't get the three. Well, that's fine. This is me not caring. <laughs> 
You have two little koi tiles next to each other. Hmm. They're friends. There are no accidents, just happy little mistakes. Is that a Bob Ross comment? Is that what that is? <laughs> I'm also a big fan of the fact that you get to see the other player, what the other player has, so you can try to like make sure that they don't get certain things to continue advancing, you know? You're a big fan of that, huh? I'm a big fan of that. This is like hate drafting. <laughs> <laughs> is what that is. I'm not surprised <laughs> that you are a big fan of that. How do I give them the least amount of stuff possible? Shutting it down. So rude. So rude. They did a good job with this where all the little lanterns are floating and... It's pretty. It's pretty. It's a pretty looking little board game. It app. is right. It's so pretty, and is that was one of my favorite things about it. I was like, man, it is so nice and like just pretty and relaxing to play this game because the way that the koi are swimming through there, and it has like really relaxing music associated with it and stuff. I was like, dang, they did a good job on this, guys. I always like this game. We played this one a lot when we first got it. It's a good little gateway game. That can get more and more intense with the the level of the, the players. more yeah the more gamers that end up playing with it it gets super intense sometimes and then with it, it's something that you can very easily introduce to any non gamer or kid as well because you're just matching colors you know you just got to make sure you sit exactly like on the right sides of everything. <laughs> So you don't get confused by who gets what tiles, right? Whenever you're first starting. <laughs> that is true. <gasps> are you going to give me cool stuff? Or are you going to make it so I don't get any tiles again, Dr. Glory Hog? That was shifty. That was shady. So rude. What do you mean? You know you know what you did. You know there, what you I gave did. you like all red. Calm down. Did you not get any last time I placed? Yeah. Oh, wow. Okay, I wasn't even paying attention to that. I'll have to pay more attention. <laughs> <laughs> I just wanted to get to the rainbow first. Because I knew you were going for it based off what you got in your hand. There it is. There what is? What? You got the little rainbow going on. I did. Ooh, it's funny playing oh, this in the same room as somebody because, like, the way stuff comes up, like, I'm doing my turn, but your, my turn doesn't actually go through instantaneously, but it does on your end. So, like, it takes a while, so I'm doing all these things, I'm maneuvering stuff around and everything, and then all of a sudden it instantaneously drops through, you know? Boom. What do I want to do? <laughs> All right. Um, let's do let's do some exchanging here like that. And then yeah, let's do some of that. Let's just take some of those. Totes fine. Totes fine. And now let's play something now that I have nothing. <laughs> now that I have nothing. So sad. I really don't feel like your turn just flies by on my end, just as a FYI. Like it just flies it by. It doesn't now. feel instantaneous. No. It's just you waiting for that You're just to like, drop. come on, hurry up. Yeah. I see how it is. I see how it is. I've got things to do. Eat my Chipotle. <laughs> the nice thing is the game was only five bucks too. That's less than the cost of one Chipotle burrito. <laughs> <laughs> That's good. Man, the stuff I want to put down, like, I don't want you to get any of the things, Dr. Glory Hog. Stop overstressing trying to, to screw me and just <laughs> work on your own plan. <laughs> it's which, which is funny because you always accuse me of doing that to you where you're like, you placed that just to shut me down. I'm like, no, I'm really worried about maximizing my points. I'm not even looking at your side. And then that's what you actually do. You actually do try to do that. What? Yeah. 
What? So Battlecry has used their printer to make game inserts, card trays, 3D tile pieces for terraforming Mars, player trays, and trays for their board game friends and stuff like that, which is awesome. I believe we have somebody uh, who made us some like little doors and stuff like that for Gloomhaven. And I'm always interested in people that are making stuff with 3D printers because that stuff is so cool. You can make such like fascinating, interesting stuff and like people building new things like it's another hobby. It's a whole other hobby like that I don't have time to get into right now, but I'm super curious and interested in it, you know, because you can do so much with it. So much fun. All right, Dr. Glory Hog, give me all right the good there. things. Hey, hey, if you could give me things that I need, please. No, stop getting stuff. I'm you need to stop. stop, sir. I'm never going to stop. I need, like, the perfect lineup of things, and I don't have the perfect lineup of things. Well, disappointingly, all I did was tie it up with you, so. You're disappointed by that? Yeah. Why I'm are you disappointed by that? Because I want to win. I don't want to tie. <laughs> I want to spend all my turns tying it up. I see. Uh, I don't really have a whole lot of stuff that I want to do there. Try that, but that's not going to be, like, super great. What are you going for? Maybe I can help you out. <laughs> I'm not going to tell you that, Dr. Glory Hog. Why not? What's wrong with you? How's it going to stop your plans for world domination? Well, the problem is I don't want to give Dr. Glory Hog anything because he has too many things, and I don't like it. I don't like it. Yeah, there's definitely one thing that if you give me, and that's just it. Checkmate. Wow. Well, thanks for letting me know. Thanks for giving me the heads up. You're welcome. <laughs> oh, okay. I need to put that one down, I think. You do need to place a tile, yes. Every well. turn. <laughs> the tile I want to place, I can't put anywhere good. So that's not going to be helpful. Play a tile. Play a tile. Oh my gosh, Dr. Glory Hog, you need to stop. <laughs> I mean, this is not going to go well. Are you using your calculator right now? What are you doing? I'm not using my calculator. You got out of like a compass and you're trying out some different strategies here? Uh, you're trying to pressure me is what you're doing. You're trying to pressure me into making a really bad move is what it is. No, I'm not actually. I'm just... Trying to get to my Chipotle before I die. You need that Chipotle burrito. Boom. Checkmate. Why was that checkmate? Checkmate. All right. Let's see what I got. Can I get the things that I need? You're going for red orange. You're never gonna get them. Probably not, but we will try. Oh yeah, thank <laughs> you. <laughs> hmm, what dedication do I want to make? I think I know which dedication you want to make. Because you're shady. Let's do three pair. I mean, another thing with the dedications is the fact that for the more expensive one, you're just expending more cards. So it's not always necessarily the best one to do if you're not getting a lot of lanterns coming in. You know, if I did the seven lanterns, seven different colored lanterns every single time, but I was only gaining like two lanterns every turn, like that's not going to be beneficial overall to me later, you know? Oh, that was good to know. 
Does that make sense? Yeah, thank you. <laughs> You're welcome. <laughs> Appreci appreciate your preaching. Preach on, sister. How did we leave a hole in the middle of the lake? I feel like there's a very special piece that goes there, and I want that piece really badly. <sighs> I already have it. You mm. can't have it. I'm going to get, like, three out of the four. It's going to be so many. It's going to be, like, Three lanterns. out of the four what? Three out of the four lantern colors. It's going to be crazy. Oh, if you go in that little square there? Oh, I'm going to go in that little square there. Why are you going to go in the square? Because I want three bonus <laughs> lanterns plus my regular <laughs> lantern. I'm going to straight up get four lanterns in a turn. Wow, that's rude, sir. The max you can get is, like, what, five? Right? If lanterns in a turn? Yeah, because you get four from all the sides plus the side that's facing you. If you yeah. can match it up. Yeah, I would assume so, yeah. Oh, my God. You're ahead by a point. One point. Wow, that was a weak play. It was weak. It was. Just trying to shut me down. But huh? it made it so you can't get any little favors off of that. So I actually didn't have anything for there. I was just talking crap. I was going to go there anyway. I was talking crap. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't have anything. Didn't have anything. But neither did you. Bark, bark, bark. How often do you use the favors, Dr. Glory Hog? Is that something that you use <laughs> all the time? Mm, it just depends. If I can, I'll use it if I can turn it in right away. Yeah. Otherwise, what's the point? Like, this is going to be a lower scoring game for me, I think. I'm a point behind you, and I do not like five, six. All right. Let's see what I can do here. You can give me all the things. <laughs> Let's try this, I guess. Let's see. This is going to go one of two ways. We're, we'll see how this works out. Also, like, whenever I'm playing on stream, I never feel like I'm operating to my fullest. <laughs> like, I'm always looking up at different things and checking the stream. So I feel like I'm like handicapped for these particular games. So I don't feel like this is a clear definition of <laughs> how well <What>? I do. <laughs> because you have to look at the screen occasionally. <laughs> like that's it. Like, oh, I got to look at the screen every once in a while, guys. I can't be trusted. What? I had to look at the screen once. So that's it. That's can't be trusted. That's right. Oh, my gosh. I just played a bonehead move. I dropped that purple and there's no purples left. Ooh. Ouch. Well, nobody got anything. That was just a wasted Ouch. turn. I thought I was going to get two purples. Instead, I got zero. It's because, you know, I was, like, looking up at my screen. I was looking at you. And I just, I really feel like this isn't really, like, the epitome of my excellence. And I feel like, <laughs> like, I would be, like, amazing if, like, I wasn't under the microscope of humanity. Oh, really? Totes. Oh, my gosh. But just by observing me, I'm going to react differently because as soon as you observe an object, it just changes how it reacts. So by just merely observing me, you are – you done? No, I'm not. Oh, my God. I thought after all that talk, you would be done. I didn't like this round. I um, was not able to get a bunch of good stuff, I don't feel like. Oh, yeah? Yeah. wasn't a super big fan of it. As far as, like – I could never get – there's one specific color I just never had. You must have had all the, the, the tiles of that particular color because, like, I never got it, like, the whole round, I feel like. I feel like I was just been trading for that one color. I think I set myself up for the loss for by not paying attention here because I just made a – not a super great move, Did I think. Did you lay a maybe. tile? I don't know. We'll see. No, I haven't laid a tile yet, Oh, though. my God. Oh, my gosh. I'm so sorry. How could you make a bad move about taking a thing? I'm like. so sorry. <laughs> Don't apologize to me. Apologize to our fans. <laughs> Some of them have things to do tonight. <laughs> like watch our stream. No? <laughs> We've only been streaming for like 10 minutes. 
What? No way. It's no, been oh, forty. It's been forty-one. Yeah, six thirty. Yeah. I was, thinking, I was like seven ten. How did we only was drink for ten minutes? You're like, uh <laughs> I'm like, your turns take Why? ten minutes. Oh, Doctor Glory Hog. What? So rude. You get a little bit of analysis paralysis in games like this. And I do I because I always want. I'm always thirsting for that perfect move, and it just doesn't exist. It doesn't. It doesn't exist the majority of the time, and that's the sad part. That's the sad part. I mean, I don't want to give you that. Don't want to give Doctor Glory Hog that, guys. I will give him not that either. <laughs> oh my God! Please, <gasps> I already gave you an opportunity give him to that. win by just dropping a tile that did nothing at all. Did you actually give me anything or no? I did. I gave you one thing. You got one orange. That's well, all I could do. I should have kept the purples and done nothing with them. Well, yippity doo da. That's what I should have done. I should have done my hate drafting. I don't think I can do anything with what I've got here. Because there's no way I'm going to get three tiles off of something. <laughs> Jeremiah says, "Ah, oh, the banter is so worth while. Worth the while." <laughs> oh, maybe I just set myself up for something. I once again did not look though, so I could have. No, I'm one little favorite. Give me token things. Away. I need the things. Give me all of them. Come on. So close. Doctor Glory Hog. <sighs> what? What is wrong with you? You did not give me the things I wanted. I gave you a purple. Calm down. Purple is <laughs> your favorite color. <gasps> That's all right. I'm going to be sitting here at the end oh with three blacks and not be able to do anything. Yeah, right. this is not going to be I'm not going to be able to turn in another one. Can you turn in another one this turn? I mean, I have one tile left. Oh, so you got two more chances to turn in, technically. Yeah. Yeah, see, I only got one more chance so to turn in. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to... Spike gonna that s punch. Still going to put me out by one on that. So let's see here. If I do that this turn on there, I can't do that. Okay. So yeah, we're going to do. I'm going to grab a quick cat nap. That. You let me know when you're done. <laughs> we're going to do that. This is the super shadiest way of doing this, guys, right here, okay? And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to make sure that I get one of these. There's not much you have like to do this, here. Like this, okay? And I'm setting myself up. Boom, I won. No! What? We're supposed to have one final turn in, I thought. I don't know. Oh, my gosh. I thought so, too. Oh, no. No. <laughs> Undefeated. Undefeated. Why does this always Undefeated. happen to me online? <laughs> it happens in real life, too, but we just don't talk about it. Yeah, we don't talk about those things. We don't talk about oh those look, things. Look, I get happening. a level up. You know what? You I'm shush a level two your mouth over there. I don't <laughs> want to hear about your levels up and everything. Okay, no, we're not continuing. Lanterns. What's my? Reason? I love you, but you hurt me today. You hurt me today. I think I'm called the dabbler now <laughs> or something. <laughs> I'm being serial oh right now. Oh my gosh! Well, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream and us playing lanterns. This is. By far, like, just one of my favorite games that I love playing with people. The round base turns on this. You go ahead and you make your move, and then after it's done, it alerts the other player whenever they are ready. Throughout the day, during their time, they can go ahead and pull it up and then play their turn and go back and forth. I love that sort of turn-based play. I bet you probably play. love that crazy long turn-based play where no one yes. expects you to come back for an hour because yeah. you get no pressure, and you can just look at it for 30 minutes and be like, oh. Well, it's the perfect sort of thing to play with people who have AP like that, you know, like when they get analysis paralysis, like <laughs> you're like, here, have a day to make your choice. Have fun with that. And then you can come back later. You know, what when you get that. What was the other game we used to play like that? We used to play a lot on our phones. Um, it's got the tiles that are like the red X, the orange X, the blue X, and it's got like a little cross, and then it's got the circle, and it's got the square. Are we talking about tic-tac-toe? <laughs> No, All I'm hearing is this. Oh, oh, Quirkle. Quirkle. Yes. Oh, my God. I love Quirkle, Quirkle so Quirkle much. <gasps> but phones. Because that was another one that you could just take your turn and then, like, let it sit. It wasn't Quirkle on the phone, though, because it was, like, called Pirates or something yeah. weird like that. But it was Quirkle, the game. Yeah. Except it was, like, rebranded as something else. And I don't know how they got 
away with that. Away with maybe that, yeah. Did. Maybe that's why I don't see it anymore. Maybe, maybe, yeah. Be, but Quirkle is another The mighty hammer of Quirkle game. came down and shut them oh down. Gosh. Yeah, I wish, I wish we had a game app for Quirkle because I would play that. I play the heck out of that, you know. Like it's Do you ever shape get any Scrabble. Work done? <laughs> play the heck out of that. I would. I would play the heck out of that. <laughs> I'd be heckin' mad and play the heck out of that. <laughs> so this does have solo play, and of course you can play with tons of other people. Well, not tons. You can play up to four players on this, and you can do a pass and play. And then there's ranked matches as well, which I have not t done anything in the ranked matches, so I don't know how competitive that is. Let's see if. We have rankings. Oh, okay, so I don't have, I haven't been set up for leaderboards and stuff like that. But thank you so much for joining me for the stream today, guys. If there's a specific game that you guys want to see played that is an app-based game, let me know in the comments so I can go ahead and make that possible. Is there anything else you want to say, Dr. Glory Hog? If there's a, a, reg a regular board game you want to see us play, feel free to send us a copy and we'll learn it and play it. <laughs> if we don't have it, of course. Well, I hope to play... Irish Gage this weekend. Well, what did we just get in from Kickstarter? Didn't we just get in? We got Tussie Mussy and we got Lovelace and Babbage. And so fancy. I know we still have War of the Worlds to play and stuff. Oh, I've so played it. I've mastered it. I know, but I'm saying like on stream, we still have that to play. We should be able to put those up here soon, though. So thank you, everybody who hung out with us tonight. We will talk to you later. And make sure to stay tuned for Kickstarters on Fridays. Thanks for watching.